Hey CFS Warriors, it's Victoria coming to you from Mexico. You can see the beautiful waves rolling in behind me. I just want to talk to you tonight about hope, courage, determination, and discipline. So I want to encourage you to have hope. Hope is so important. There's a beautiful song that has always inspired me with CFS Recovery. And it says, when hope fades into the dark of night. And you know, I felt like my hope faded so often throughout this illness. And it's so important to keep our hope alive. And there are things that we can do to keep our little flame from being snuffed out. So we need to take responsibility for that little flame of ours and remember to feed ourselves with positive, good, uplifting things that will feed our hope for recovery. One of the main things that's done that for me has been um, recovery stories because when you hear that other people have recovered and how they did it, though it may be different from your path, there are some gems that you can usually pull out from other people's recovery stories. And the other thing I want to talk about is courage. And you all have this. I mean, going through an illness like this and being determined to recover, you are full of courage. And courage is going to give you that extra power that you need to get through those really tough times to try something one more time, to be willing to take a risk on one more thing without giving up hope. So the last thing is determination. And I think it's really important to have hope, and yet we can't just have hope, and we can't just have courage. We need to have determination and discipline in doing something, doing a program, doing what it takes, making sure that we're doing the things that we know are good for our health, whether that's getting your sleep right, getting a coach to help you with recovery, help with your nutrition. So determination to do those things that you know will help you on the recovery path and the discipline to keep it going long term. It's so easy to try a program and then think it's not working. If it's not working, talk to the person, talk to the coach, talk to whoever's running the show and explain what's going on and find out where you can find gene things. So these are just some attributes I think that we all possess having gone through this very difficult illness and that we need to continue to encourage in ourselves and to fan the flame. So anyway, take care, warriors. Hope that helps. And remember, life's not over. It's starting again. If you're in recovery and you can use some more encouragement, be sure to subscribe. And if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. That lets me know. And it also helps it reach more people that could use some encouragement that might be in some dark places. Thank you.